I think they have like multiple use cases that you can use for agent mode. You can actually generate reports. You can do actions or perform actions on a website. You can uh, fill spreadsheets with a lot of information, and you can also create uh, presentations looking at certain information in websites. So all of these are possible. But yeah, so there are different types of platforms that you can create agents for. So ChatGPT agent is more like okay, you give it a prompt, it'll actually do certain things, but it's still limited. There are also extensive agent uh, platforms like N8N and Lindy. So think of these both as you can actually go in and build all the workflows which you wanted to. So imagine you are like a um, maybe like a marketing team who's trying to get leads of customers and all. So for that, a marketing team has to basically maybe do a lot of marketing messaging and all of that stuff. And when somebody replies to some of these. marketing messages the individual person has to pitch certain things and they might have questions they there's back and forth and then maybe they'll schedule a call where they'll demo their product.